Hey fellas, well, this year has, I'm not going to sugarcoat this point, it was not the best one I had, it's just, it may have been the post of worst one I've experienced, I mean, and I know that's kind of like a hot take already, but, like, out of the last five, I don't think it's your bronze, I mean, unless something happens, and heaven forbid, in the, in the, in the next, next, oh, say, hey, just over, for 39 hours, hours as I record this, I mean, this, I'm not sure anything else, else can really, the, I can further tell them this one to officially just, as, as bug off, I mean, I mean, but still, as someone who's gone through multiple different body types, hairstyles, and beard styles, I mean, and family locations and conditions, gotten picked up by Maker, gotten dropped by Maker, has seen Maker devour its own tail. I can definitely say that uh, it's also one that continually proved to me both, both in and out of my videos. I have my last one for the year ready to go already. Other ones I had in mind will probably get bumped to early 2021. Like, um, my goal is still the same for like to finish the Ultra Adventures vlogs by February 27th and have most of the other videos I was I was working on out and ready by the end of the first quarter earliest, I mean, uh, so, you know, it just proves to me sometimes you make, had to make some lemon ass and dang lemons sometimes, because that's what I'm taking away from this, so, this reflections video is going to be a bit different than usual, all about going over, over things collectively, okay, as well as offering my plans for, or uh, the just channel like next year I'll mark 13 years of being a member of the site as well as 10 years uploading I mean that's really something I would have expected this would be a trajectory I'd be taking and but there we are so let's keep going yeah so while I won't be going to every single minute detail hail of things been going on because but if you've been following things in the capacity, you're gonna know what I'm talking about. Oh, it's, there are things that actually I have been impacting at in the most subtle ways, and just being here, here, in many ways, think my own hobbies have me better equipped to deal with all this than others have. Have so. There's that, and. And definitely managed to procure her a couple more pops if I've been after for a while. I mean, what was one Squirtle? Definitely rounding up my one of the OG Pokemon stars I already have, like the the Charmander Peach on my shelf. It's just it's not in the shop, but it's over there on the left. I mean, not to mean. I already showed you like my Sol Pro controller and my. I switch experience for two years later vid, I mean, and even though i have mostly been I'm getting along against my PS4 lately, I definitely will be a, a get getting some more my Switch, depending if and when, and this stimmy comes, I mean, yeah, there's been a lot of FOP and Jimmy Neutron means with that, I mean, one other kind of one of the ones I kind of get me up is like having Ike with like the like the pack of gum as well as like the pile of Bennigan's coupons, man. Ones, man. Ones, man. I think those are all the time where uh, they, they got bought up by Royals to teach our Fridays and they became to honor branding. But I'm gonna hit that myself. We two strikes back evolution. Even though we oh oh as my sister Dogasha pointed out we don't know when oh, the next movie's gonna be like. Like have they like, they didn't even have like a stinger announcing the next one like they usually do. 
who this one looks quite good in HD. It's not quite as just a Pikachu movie, but it is still you know, one that it just does not bother me. I mean, I'd be open to like a in, like a remake of Mutual Returns in the style among other potential full CG films, I mean films, I mean and one thing I noticed, not sure if anyone else has it has a speedy he did that apparently he the monster's cries were, were muted in the denouement, I mean, like, which is how it was in the Japanese version. It's just like a vanilla one with just like the movie itself and the English dub on it. On it, but what I mostly wanted was to see this thing in HD when I don't have a connection going. I fulfill that purpose, I mean, yes, and it's definitely. I don't really don't know about the whole shop or shop one. It's definitely like a new Hope Force Awakens kind of situation in my book where there are parallels in the plot, but the new one has enough stand on its own. You can enjoy it that way. And a couple more Amiibo I've been after. I mean, Ivysaur and Squirtle, which definitely rounds out the Pokemon trainers Ross to a Charizard. Like, I named my trainer Satoshi a, as someone who doesn't really, really, really like to pick and choose whose ones like people like to debate Ash or Red, I say, why not both? I mean both I mean especially given how I did mine with a call out skin on it, I mean and as I keep pointing out, I will most likely be reviewing Between Secrets of the Jungle once it does come out officially in English, I mean my guess is that it's gonna be another that one that they use on Netflix first because there's things we're still gonna be a in and the an extreme risk until after my 29th. But as someone who already celebrated the 28th on a smaller scale, like the most I had in mind were like pizza and a cake, which I think can be procured very easily without uh, going all out. I mean, heck. It's easier for me to get six people together online than it is IRL, I mean, although I know personally. So I did take some of his future for myself in a way, a, even if some of the situations, like, were pretty ridiculous, like, some of them once I understood, like, the PS5, because I already kind of saw that coming, I mean, I mean, with the components not being, they had to cut their shipments, they're going to try to up them up, given how the whole... All of the million units, units have been sold out, both physical and digital only. Only, they, they're they trying to up the production, and some of the scalpers are even getting sued, but the whole thing with the bath tissue, which I pointed out this year, was just ridiculous. I mean, it was also the same date where I uploaded that video. Oh, that was right when I realized things kind of gonna get serious, I mean, serious, I mean, while I had, like, the snake salute as a, as a thumbnail, I mean, you know, I mean, going, like, what, I even, like, I called people, and I was like, guys, hey, you see, it's gonna have to scrub the plants for now, I mean, I mean, you might say that I haven't totally canceled anything yet, it's just, more than likely, things have been kind of delayed, I mean, it's so... I mean, now have I have it going hot into into some newer stuff uh, in this st situation. I mean, managed to get through all of the Owl House, which I'll be watching on Disney Plus with the second season coming, presumably in twenty twenty one. On, on. I mean, I'll probably do my my wrap up of the of the second season of His Dark Material, since unfortunately the extra episode they were planning had eventually has been scrapped at I mean because of coronavirus which James McAvoy and the creative team confirmed and but on the good news is is the next the third and final season is going to be based on Amber Spyglass is still coming so I need to, I can still get caught up for that I think as like earlier this year I even like I had to bump my finale of the Watchmen series which even though Lindelof is not going to be involved with her second season, if someone and, and else want to do it, I'm sure they could definitely capture that feeling and 
definitely. And I mean, some people said like it was like the fidelity of the novel that was a, a problem with original film from 2009, even though others were just like change, the changes made. I mean, heck, I'm one of those people that actually liked it more on second viewing. I mean, so I'll also be using that as a barometer for the upcoming Zack Snyder's Just Like HBO Max. And as I pointed out, and I also saw a game like Wonder Woman 84 review, I'll probably do the spoiler review before or it gets off the platform. I will just deal with that as it comes. I just mean, I just mean, and I'll def I definitely will be also giving you my brief if ones are ones I definitely know for sure I want to do, and also other ones I'm considering in the next cuts. Okay, so for certain, as I mentioned before, my review of Soul, that for the 35th anniversary of history of the studio, I definitely want to finally get at my Pixar Marathon, uh, where I would review every film I have not reviewed them, from the first Toy Story to 2017's Coco, uh, thereby meaning, meaning there would be no Onward heard, no Monster University, Hey, no Inside Out, and no Cars 2 or 3. I also like to do for my next 80s film, film retrospective, or at least age franchise, all four standalone Predator movies. I mean, apparently the third, the third of the reboot Alien films is now going to be tooled into a TV series for FX. It's, I thought it would have been on Hulu, but... I think FX could work, given especially with Holy, given his work on both Legion and Fargo, oh, doing those material justice. A look at the Lord of the Rings trilogy. A look at uh, the first five Mission Impossible movies before Fallout, given how the seventh and eighth are being filmed at the same time. Insert crews going off on on the crew for breaking protocols here, here. I found that highly amusing, but for a variety of reasons, and even though Tom is definitely no stranger, conscious of any means, heck, in my lifetime, I lived through, like, the infamous incidents on Oprah, as well as, uh, it's like the whole tired against Brooke Shields on today, granted this before Lauer's own discussions were outed, but still, I mean, I mean, I mean, heck, you as Andy, I might as well be a bit more frank than usual more sense and there's still more, yet more coming I definitely have some other videos I want to do who like I've definitely been talking a lot more about video games games in this case where here definitely I'll be focusing a lot I definitely have plenty of videos planned for not just like a 25th anniversary Pokemon but also like the 35th of Zelda which as I point out is my favorite non Pokemon Nintendo franchise easily hey I mean, Mario was one that got me started, but Zelda is one of the ones that that I cemented my love for the series, and I think we need something like that to remind us, us especially after, some, even though I have not been personally as affected, had difficulty as a requiring Zaru to side, by the, shall we say, more divisive policies these have had, but I'm gonna hit myself. So... Oh, the last one, and I, and I definitely, hey, now I want to do for sure is, is a Bondathon of every single canon film I haven't viewed yet. That's from Doctor No in 1962, all the way to Quantum of Solace, almost in, almost in 2008. I was already contemplating hitting doing this. Well, this, this before after No Time to Die got delayed more than once. And, and especially after both Netflix and Apple TV offered her the, the studio six hundred million dollars for streaming rights and they turned them down. You know what I mean? You know what I mean? When I say hey every canon film that would be like every one that Eon Films has produced, I mean by Albert R. Broccoli, later his daughter Barbara, uh, took over the, her after his passing. And 
That main style 967 Casino Royale, which is kind of like a proto awesome Powers of Kingsman. No Climax Casino Royale, which is like an hour long TV movie, which interestingly swapped the affiliations of Bond and Lighter, where normally Bond's MI6 and Lighter has American contact in the CIA. Hey, hey, they made. Bond, an American named Jimmy in the CIA, and later a British MI6 agent, and no, no, it's never again. There will be getting in detail about some of the productions ones in this marathon, but on potentially, especially in regards to Kevin McClory made it so we only just now be able to legally use Blofeld and Spectre again. And yes, I'll include like the Opening a few eyes only, being like some black little finger to McClory, and maybe even the inspiration of Dr. Evil, I don't know. Other ones considering? Considering? I just put a question mark to be ensure a plan of the apes, apes perspective of the entire franchise. A Harry Potter marathon of all eight main films, as well as like my off delayed review of the second Fantastic Beast. Because even if I were to move like the behavior of some of the cast and the screenwriter side, I definitely don't think I have to nail the third one. Because a purely objective point of view it is, even though audiences were somewhat forgiving towards it, I had to critically and commercially the lowest performing installment of fans of dates. Eight, I mean and every Nicktoon ever so far her I guess that's to be determined. I mean if I was going to do it, would I definitely be Rather than indiv individually in every Nicktoon, I would be having them in volumes like one from the 1990s and but for the 2000s, the 2010s, and the present day, I'd be splitting those into in those, those into parts where, given how the halves of those decades were so distinctly different in terms of how they present themselves, it would be a necessity because I'd be looking at at all the ones released there collectively, and when I say Nicktoon, whether it would be on airing on the main a network, Eric, or the Nicktoon sister network, or heck, even on streaming like Glitch Text, end up debuting. I mean, I mean, I definitely hope that I could definitely do this injustice. And it's nothing personal, John, on about your our thoughts, man. If I don't totally agree with them. I try not to who look back and anger if I can and I mean and so in any case if I were to tell you that your dislike of Puckle Rick, Rise to and T, your name or even the fine system my jack is only personal, you don't want to be lying. I personally I never could get in his ash bill or growing up. I mean, I'm always right. Even if I do, I think it's kind of like a light hated and sort of Jewish bizarre adventure in many ways. Like, my ask is like, what would happen if you had had any of the JoJo's in this series? I guess the answer would be a much shorter anime. Hey. So, that's all I gotta say for now. Now, and I wish yes, all of you. Oh guys, guys, a very happy new year, because frankly, I think we're all going to need it later. Here's your better 2021. Mm.